This video is to honor courageous Roosevelt High School students who gave their lives serving our country in the military, beginning with the first class of 1923 from World War II through today's current military activities, many of our brave young men made the ultimate sacrifice. Several volunteered and joined up even before graduation, never returned, and were given posthumous diplomas. In memory of the Roosevelt students who served in the U.S. military and later died as a result of their service, we honor and remember their sacrifice. In addition, we feel that it is important to honor the family members of those that we lost. With sorrow and great pride, we present a few details about our heroic classmates. Grover Cleveland Barron Jr., Class of 1941, U.S. Army Air Corps, killed in action in World War II, 1944. He was a gunner on a B-24 Liberator bomber. Robert Orlo Bissett, Class of 1928, U.S. Army, died from injuries he sustained in combat in Belford, Italy, June 28, 1944. Burial at Wilhelm's Portland Memorial Mausoleum. Walter Anthony Chulo, Class of 1941, U.S. Navy. Wally was assigned to the USS Bismarck Sea, an aircraft carrier, as a physical fitness instructor. He was killed in action on February 21, 1945, when two Japanese kamikaze planes sank the USS Bismarck Sea near Iwo Jima. The St. John's community lost three young men on the USS Bismarck Sea. Walter Chulo, Richard Wilson, class of 1944, and Eldred Johnson, Benson, class of 1942. All three are buried at sea. Walter played on Roosevelt's first championship basketball team and was chosen for the All-Star team in 1941. At the time of Wally's enlistment into the U.S. Navy, he was a student and played basketball for the University of Portland. Casper Emanuel Hendrickson, class of 1940, U.S. Navy. Casper was killed in action on February 1, 1943, while assigned to the USS De Haven, a Navy destroyer, during a Japanese dive bomb attack in the South Pacific. Casper was posthumously awarded the Purple Heart. Casper is buried at sea. Harold Henry Locke, class of 1941, U.S. Army Air Corps Lieutenant killed in action in October 1944 while serving as a B-24 bomber pilot with the 12th Air Force. Harold was student body president in 1939. He played basketball for Roosevelt. Harold attended the University of Oregon before entering the U.S. Army Air Force in 1943. Robert C. Miles, class of 1938, U.S. Army Sergeant, killed in action on August 17, 1944, associated with the D-Day Normandy invasion, June 6, 1944. It should be noted that Robert Miles was the brother of Lieutenant Colonel George Miles, class of 1933, who served as a Royal Air Force fighter pilot and a fighter pilot with the U.S. Air Force during World War II and the Korean War. Orville Edward Monteith, class of 1939, U.S. Army, Private First Class, killed in action on November 5, 1944. He was a member of the 7th Infantry Division and had participated in three major battles. The Purple Heart was presented to his widow, Frances Monteith. He was also survived by his two-year-old son, Robert. Edward Alvin Patterson, class of 1936, U.S. Navy pilot, Ensign. His plane went down on June 16, 1944, while on patrol in the South Pacific. Edward attended Portsmouth School and was the only child of Mr. and Mrs. A. E. Patterson. At Roosevelt, Edwards played football, was on the track team, was on the student council, and was a member of the Letterman's Club. He is buried at Willamette National Cemetery. Richard Rawls, class of 1935, U.S. Army Forces, first lieutenant, assigned to the 332 Bomber Squadron, 94th Bomber Group. Richard Rawls was the pilot of a B-17 bomber named Casey Jones, killed in action on November 11, 1943, when his bomber was shot down over Germany. His air medal with an oak leaf was presented to his widow, Mrs. Sidney Rawls. There is a plaque and a memorial for Richard Rawls and his bomber crew at The Missing at Cambridge American, England. Leroy Merrill Schroeder, class of 1940, 
U.S. Army Paratrooper, attached to the U.S. Army 508th Parachute Infantry Regiment, 82nd Airborne Division. Leroy Schroeder jumped from his plane on D-Day, the Normandy invasion, on June 6, 1944, between 2.02 a.m. and 2.20 a.m. Leroy's family had received information that he was captured and held as a prisoner of war until his death on June 13, 1944. Leroy Schroeder had attended James John Grammar School. Leroy's brother, Sergeant Melvin Schroeder, attended Roosevelt as well. Melvin was captured by the Germans during the Normandy invasion and was able to escape and survived the war. Leroy left behind his pregnant wife, Marie, who would give birth to Leroy's only child a mere three weeks after Leroy's death. Leroy Schroeder is buried at Lincoln Memorial Park in Portland. Stanley Herbert Tucker, Class of 1941, U.S. Army, paratrooper assigned to the 513 Infantry Division, killed in action on January 7, 1945, in Belgium. Stanley Tucker was awarded the Purple Heart and the Bronze Star. He was a James John Grammar School and Roosevelt High graduate. He was survived by his widow, Alita, and two-month-old son. Richard Wilson, Class of 1944, U.S. Navy. Killed in action on February 21, 1945, when the USS Bismarck Sea was sunk by two kamikaze planes, Richard Wilson graduated from James John Grammar School and Roosevelt High School. Richard Wilson was 19 years old when he was killed. Gideon Joseph Wolfe Jr., Class of 1944, U.S. Navy. Killed on December 18, 1944, at the age of 18, while assigned to the USS Hulls, a destroyer. The USS Hulls went down during a typhoon. James W. Yen, Class of 1941, U.S. Army Air Forces Sergeant, killed in action on July 14, 1943. Sergeant James Yen was a radio operator on a C-47 transport plane. Assigned to the 60th Troop Carrier Group and participated in Operation Fustion. The mission was dropping British paratroopers during the night of July 13th and 14th on drop zones south of Sicily. Sergeant Yen's plane was shot down by anti-aircraft fire. James Yen's parents were presented with their son's air medal with an oak leaf cluster during a presentation at the Portland Air Base. Sergeant Yen is buried at the Sicily Rome American Cemetery in Italy. Albert E. Danes, Class of 1944, killed in action on April 5, 1945, U.S. Army Air Forces. Albert Danes was assigned to the 8th Air Force, 18th Bomber Squadron, as a waste gunner on a B-17 Flying Fortress bomber. He had taken part in 16 missions over Germany. Albert Danes was awarded the Air Medal with an Oak Leaf Cluster, Purple Heart, and the Presidential Citation. Donald P. Younts, Class of 1947, U.S. Army, Private, First Class. Younts was a member of the 171's Field Artillery Battalion, 45th Infantry Division. He was killed in action while fighting the enemy in North Korea on July 10, 1952. He attended Peninsula Grade School, played football and baseball at Roosevelt High School. Donald Younts was awarded the following medals, the Purple Heart, National Defense Service Medal, Korean Service Medal, Republic of Korea Presidential Unit Citation, United Nations Service Medal, Republic of Korea War Service Medal. Donald Younts is buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland. David Leroy Clark, Class of 1967, U.S. Army Private First Class, killed in action in Vietnam on September 21, 1968, with small arms fire. He attended Sitton Grade School. David Clark was awarded the following medals, the Purple Heart, the Vietnam Campaign Medal, Vietnam Service Medal, Combat Infantryman Badge. David Clark is buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland. Jimmy Sherman Daffron, Class of 1965, U.S. Marine Corps, Lance Corporal, killed in action in Vietnam on November 15, 1966. Buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland. Eugene H. Dietz, Class of 1963, 
U.S. Marine Corps, died on August 21, 2007, as a result of exposure to Agent Orange during the Vietnam War. Ricky Lynn French, class of 1969, U.S. Army, died on September 27, 2015, as a result of exposure to Agent Orange during the Vietnam War. Ricky French is buried at Willamette National Cemetery in Portland, Oregon. Terry Adam Gray, class of 1966, U.S. Marine Corps Lance Corporal, killed in action in Vietnam on January 15, 1968, Terry was age 19 at the time of his death. He was on the swim team at Roosevelt High School. Terry Gray is buried at Skyline Memorial Gardens in Portland. Robert C. Grove, class of 1963, U.S. Marine Corps, killed while home on leave from Vietnam on January 30, 1967 in a traffic crash. Robert participated in the following while attending Roosevelt. He was student body president, played on the football team and participated in varsity track and javelin, fire squad, active in the boys club. Robert Grove is buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland, Oregon. Donald Dean Holtler, class of 1962, U.S. Marine Corps Corporal, killed on June 8, 1965, when his parachute did not completely open. Donald Holter participated in the following while attending Roosevelt. Student Council Representative, Varsity Football, Spanish Club, Fire Squad, Letterman, Thanes. Donald Holter is buried at the Rose City Cemetery in Portland. David Eugene Lovegren, Class of 1967, U.S. Army Corporal. Killed in action on March 1, 1969 in Vietnam when his helicopter crashed during a combat mission. His body was not recovered. David Lovegren was 19 years old when he was killed. David J. Strawmeyer, class of 1968, U.S. Marine Corps, Corporal. David Strawmeyer died on May 26, 2015 as a result of exposure to Agent Orange while serving in the Vietnam War. David Strawmeyer had been awarded the Purple Heart for injuries he sustained in Vietnam. David Strohmeyer is buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland. Dennis George Stiles, Class of 1963, U.S. Army. Dennis Stiles died on December 4, 1974, as a result of severe injuries he had sustained during the Vietnam War. Dennis participated in the following activities while attending Roosevelt High. Varsity football team, varsity track team, varsity basketball, Letterman. Dennis Stiles is buried at the Bluff View Cemetery, Vermilion, Clay County, South Dakota. Walter A. Tashner, class of 1963, U.S. Army, killed in action on November 15, 1967, during the Vietnam War. Walter Tashner participated in the following activities while attending Roosevelt High School. Student body president, played on the volleyball team. Walter Tashner is buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland. Aaron Antrim Kent, class of 1995, U.S. Marine Corps Navy hospitalman, killed in action on April 23, 2005, in Fallujah, Iraq, when an improvised explosion device detonated while he was conducting combat operations. Aaron was described as upbeat and an athlete. He joined the Navy to pursue a medical career. He was a wrestler for the Peninsula Wrestling Club and played football for Roosevelt High. Aaron was awarded the Purple Heart Medal. Aaron Kent is buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland. David Henry Harding II, class of 1990, U.S. Army Private First Class, died March 28, 1992. David's father is David H. Harding Sr., Roosevelt Class of 1967. David's mother is Bernadine, maiden name Taylor, Roosevelt Class of 1968. David is buried at the Skyline Memorial Gardens in Portland. Ryan Curtis Oyam, class of 1997, U.S. Army National Guard Sergeant, killed on October 14, 2011, in a traffic crash while serving in the U.S. Army. Ryan Oyam had served tours in Afghanistan and Iraq. 
Ryan honorably served his country and was posthumously promoted to staff sergeant in recognition of his loyal service. Ryan Oyam is buried at the Willamette National Cemetery in Portland. Despite extensive efforts, we are missing names. If you are aware of someone whose name should be included, please contact the Roosevelt High School Alumni Association. 